Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is Mechamagos, otherwise known as Rory, to my close friends and to you people, I suppose. And we are currently in the process of rescuing the Merchant of Sargoth's brother! Now, if you were... Let's see, if you watched the last episode, you caught us uh, capturing one of the dudes alive, which is a bit of a surprise, and uh, interrogating him and finding out the kidnapper's hideout is right next to Finada. A stone's throw away. And to be honest, I'm not actually fancying taking it with uh, the troops we have. We have a woodsman, two recruits, and three militia? Is it three militia? Yes. We. I want to find a tr yep, training field. We're going there first. We're going to train our forces. Alright. Sparring practice. Oh, sorry, yeah, we're at the training field now. Now, there are four things we have here. Number one, speak with the trainer, which can result in you dueling his students. This allows you to get some good early XP. Tell you what, I'm going to go through that now. Just to give you an example, and then I'm going to stop the recording because it's kind of boring going up the ranks. It's just not very exciting. Like, that's all. Uh, I'm ready for some practice. Yep, yeah, so you fight the novices, then you fight the regulars, then the veterans, then the champions, and then you get some XP at the end. So yeah, it's piss easy, as you can see. It's one-on-one, -on -one, very easy to win. You just need to use the shield, or whatever weapon you have at your disposal. And yep, here we go. You get a random weapon, too, so... <coughs> oh, I'm not very good at whole arms just yet. Die! There we go. Anyway, yes, I'm gonna... I'm gonna stop the recording. Alright, this is the last fight with the champion fighter. And that's it. We gained 300 XP going up the ranks, and what do we get for beating the champions? We get... An another 300 XP. Does my heart good to see such promising talent. You have passed all tiers of training. You can now tell everyone that you have been trained by the master of the training field. I imagine he's quite an exuberant fellow. I wish you good luck in the tournaments! And don't forget, if you want to practice your sword work any time, just come and say the word. I think I will. Thank you, bro. Okay, yes, so that's speaking with the trainer. Uh, let's go on to sparring practice. In my opinion, this is an incredibly... I'm not sure if it's the most efficient way to train your men, but it's decent. How many opponents will you go against? I'll go against four. And I will choose randomly. So you basically take four people from your band and show them what's what. So here we go. Come on! Ooh, I don't have a lot of health. Nip, 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 nip. That's what you get. Oh, this is not going to work. Okay, we didn't really get much. It didn't go. Normally, you get. Okay, tell you what, I'm just going to show you an example. I'm going to fight one guy, because my health is clearly not up to it. And maybe my weapon proficiency as well. Okay, so... Uh, the training would have gone very well there. Let's see. How much XP? The training went perfectly. Uh, I earned 23 experience. The Vega Archer gained... Not a lot at all. That's kind of weird. Range practice. Kind of hate. I don't particularly like this, because it's just... Kick in the ass. See, look, it's just. Don't even have the right angle. There we go. Oh, I got two. That's a stug. Oh, they're watching me. I'm embarrassed. Alright. Oh yeah, if you spend three sessions at the tra- Oh, whoa, graphical glitch. If you spend three sessions at the training field, as you can see, it will pass time. Alright, let's, let's do horseback training. I'll go with the one-handed- You have to go through a track, break things on the way. I think we'll do reasonably well, to be honest. I'm not sure if I want this weapon, though, this axe. Oh yeah. Okay, it's kind of hard to see the targets, but you know, whatever. The training went quite well. Okay, good. Anyway, enough of this. Now I think we are appropriately trained. 
to go to the kidnapper's hideout and quite possibly stomp some faces. No, nope, I'm gonna go get some companions. Sorry, it has to be done. Let's go to Durham first. I like Durham. I like to try and uh, your money or your okay, life. Okay, fine, brings it. Look at that. These used to be farmers' sons. Now, look, okay, that farmer's still a farmer, but uh, everyone else is actually looking pretty damn good. I mean, look at that. Let's do this. Yeah, you guys charge. I'll go on it. We should stop at the hill so that they try to cross it and then they. Yeah. That means that they won't be able to get their ranged advantage. Come on, guys. Be quick, be quick, be quick, be quick, be quick. Oh, shit. They're already here. This is a bad idea. They're all rather good at what they do, these forest bandit bastards. The Lord Huntsman got a kill. That's kind of what I like to hear. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Uh, you die. I'm pretty sure my men can handle the rest of these guys. We need a new horse. Keeps getting arrows in the head. Careful. Cover each other. Come on. Oh no! Farmer! Farmer's lad! Don't die, Rose! You lost the farmer! No! He just wanted to go home, but what happened? I got him killed! I'm gonna go ahead and get it. Other boots. Looks slightly better. I'm gonna sell that, and that, and I'm actually gonna hold on to that. We're going to get a few um, horses that we're not actually going to ride. Reason? Because... Um, the more horses you have in your inventory... I think the max is six, just giving you a heads up. The more horses you have, the faster your party can go. Good, that's the only quest we have. I'm not letting anyone down while I'm doing this, besides my wonderful, beautiful audience. Oh, I, I got a level, I forget. Okay, um... What should I buy? I'm gonna go ahead and buy me some... Swad Militia uh, Infantry of generally a jack of all trades, master of none. So, uh... Yeah, the Swads have got the best cavalry. That's what you really need to look for them for. Visit the tavern, and who do we see? Oh my god, Deshavi! Fucking Def This is quite possibly my favorite companion. Why? She is the scout. Keep your distance, by the way. My apologies, I was merely going to say that you look a bit down on your luck. My luck? You could say that. It was my bad luck to be born to a weak father who married me off to a drunken layabout who beat me. It was my bad luck when I ran away from my husband to be taken by a group of bandits. It was my bad luck that the only one among them who was kind to me, who taught me to hunt and to fight, inspired the jealousy of the others, who knifed him and forced me to run away. But I do not count myself unlucky, stranger, no more than any other woman of Calradia, this fetid backwater, this dung heap among the nations populated by apes and jackals. Hmm, are you by any chance looking for work? I might be. I could certainly use the money. But let your followers know that I do not suffer louts and brutes. Anyone who behaves, misbehaves around me will quickly find an arrow in their gullet. I will hire you trying to shoot him on your first day. Alright then. This is awesome. Alright, Deshavi, it's time to give you some real equipment. Okay, that gives you 23. This gives you 27. Bam. Those don't give you any armor whatsoever, so here, have that. You've only got a hunting bow and a quarterstaff to your name. Let's see if we can buy you some better weapons. I think you deserve them. Because you're going to be amazing. Bow is good. Bodkin arrows are good. Let's just sell these. And yeah, the short bow. Is that a light crossbow? Excellent. 
we're all getting... Oh, hello. This means we're poor again, but now I've got uh, steel bolts. Increase the damage by two. A light crossbow, which has 44 damage on it, as opposed to the... What damage was the hunting crossbow doing? 37. You know, that's excellent. And, uh, yeah, now we're going to get a little bit angrier.